Don't forget Dunlop on the 250 Honda, the one that he rode in the TT. A bike that he was highly satisfied with, in fact, said it was one of the best, if not the best, bike he'd ridden in that category. And Dunlop back now to third place. Courtney, Lofthouse, Dunlop, the top three. And certainly at the moment, Richardson closing up. Richardson about to take a couple of places there. Two places up the field for Richardson, who really took the opportunity that it presented itself. Through these twists and turns of this Dundrod circuit, as up come the leaders once again, and it's Dunlop back in front, Dunlop back in front, with behind him Mick Lofthouse then, Number one, James Courtney, holding on to third place. These three, however, covered by the proverbial pocket handkerchief. As we go back to our onboard man, Neil Richardson. Still with that tantalizing sight ahead of him, Gary Dines, but he hasn't caught him yet. Ahead of Dines, you can just see the tail of Alan Patterson, who has got past but hasn't got away. into that hairpin once more. And they close right up as they accelerate away from the hairpin. Up towards the twists and turns that take them towards Quarry Corner and the pits. That trio still fighting it out. You can hear the crowd cheering in the background. leaders come towards us and the battle really now for second place with Courtney and Lofthouse fighting it out and because they're so close together it's allowed the leader to get away on the inside there a big dive but I don't think it changed the situation we'll have to wait and see in a moment or two and Dunlop now has pulled out a good 25 30 yards lead on the opposition behind still fighting it out it's still Lofthouse just ahead of Courtney but that little 250 Honda really going well. There's now a side-by-side -side battle going on as those positions reverse themselves again and up past goes Alan Patterson, leaving Gary Dines to work out what he's going to do next. That's the fourth, fifth, sixth battle. Jason Griffiths holding off at the moment, McCulloch. And on the back of the group was number six, Gavin Lee. And here's Dunlop. Here's the checkered flag. Here's the battle that we've been watching race long, and it looks to me as if, as I said, that tire had gone a little bit, and I think Richardson has now shot his bolt, so to speak, and he's going to finish where he is right now, which is in eighth place. Lofthouse was second, Courtney third, Griffiths, McCulloch, Lees, Dines, Patterson, then Richardson. <laughs> 